back. You're watching Overdrive. At the Aether Community Day event in Bengaluru last weekend, Aether has launched the brand's very first family-oriented scooter called the Rista. Now, it is built on a new chassis, has a bigger battery pack, offers more range and, of course, a big seat considering it's a family scooter. And you can know more about it through Chris. His walk-around video is up next. And it is all available at a very attractive price point as well. We finally have a new face to an Aetha scooter. Now this is the newly introduced Vista. Now there are two variants on offer. There's the Vista S and the Vista Z. Now the Vista S, well that's the entry level variant. Well it retails for around 1 lakh 10,000 rupees. Moving on to uh, the Vista Z, there are two variants of that. Uh, two battery versions, the, the lower capacity version. Well that will set you back by around 1 lakh 20, 25,000 rupees and the high spec variant which has the bigger battery, well, that will set you back by 1,45,000 KP. Now, on the look of it, just from the front, very unique, very different as compared to the sporty looking uh, 450, because this one, well, it's more family focused, more family oriented. That's the way that they have positioned it. And of course, it, it doesn't look all that athletic. It looks more staid and but a lot bulkier in comparison. Nice LED lights up front, 12 inch front wheel, that's a telescopic fob. Scooters, well, they are, they do have the same chassis. The, the chassis of the scooter is based on that of the 450X, but then, uh, yes, this is longer, wider, and of course, a lower center of gravity, once again, because of the batteries which are located in the footboy. Now, one of the major USPs of the scooter has to be this large 900mm feet. It's long, it's wide, and, yep, it should be very accommodating, uh, more accommodating than the 450. If you found that to be a problem, well, this one should be a lot more, a lot better suited to your needs. And of course, under the seat, when you have a large storage bay, that's 34 liters of storage area. And you have, it's very well thought of, in fact, because there's a small compartment here, small section for your, let's say, a dirty cloth or scooter wiping cloth or your bonnet and stuff like that that you want to carry and keep away from your other groceries and luggage. So a full face helmet will fit inside this storage bay. and. Uh, it also has uh, the capacity to charge Aether's newly launched Aether Elo, well, the helmet, which has the wireless charging capability. So that has been included in the Rista as well. Pretty nifty. And of course, the scooter looks the part because it doesn't really stinge as far as quality is concerned. The fit and trim is really nice. And of course, it is packing a good amount of features as well from uh, this is the top end Z variant, so this one gets the magic twist throttle. It has Aether's newly launched traction control as well. Now, the higher spec Z variant, it also gets a nice 7 inch TFT screen. On the lower S variant, well, you get a regular LCD screen, uh, more in tune with the 450, the, the standard bit. Now, with the Rista S, that is the standard version, you just have one battery pack. So, that is the 2.9 kilowatt hour battery pack which gives you a range of around 123 kilometers to a complete charge. That's what the company claim, IDC. And with the slightly more advanced tech-savvy Z variant, well, you do have the option of going in for a slightly bigger battery pack. That's the 3.7 kilowatt hour battery, which will give you a range of around 160 kilometers to a complete charge. Also get a nice backless uh, for the pillion rider for the fixed foot pegs and a very accommodating scooter. So overall, that's what the scooter is. We're going to be riding it sometime in a couple of months. So do let us know what you think about it. With that, it's a wrap on this week's edition of Overdrive. But remember, you can stay in touch with the team through our various social media platforms and you can write to us on YouTube as well. We'll see you next week. Until then, drive and ride safe. <laughs>